Okay, here we are, Matthew Russell Lee, Inner City Press, here at the Southern District of New York Courthouse today, Wednesday, August 10th, 2022. Now, we're covering a number of cases here. I'm going to start with Kevin Spacey. It's coming up in October. The trial, the civil set case, Rap versus, they call him Fowler, but it's Kevin Spacey. Uh, we covered his uh, attempt to get the case dismissed and moved. It didn't work. Now he's gotten a deposition against a guy called Vary by September 8th, but it is coming. The drumbeat. Also, Joshua Schulte, some may have noticed, and we reported, that his laptop was seized from the MDC in Brooklyn. Um, somehow the warrant is not from SDNY. Somebody wrote to EDNY, but we're getting no answers. That More on that in a moment. In any event, Judge Furman has ruled that uh, no new laptop for now, even air-gapped, if he, uh, he can just extend his deadlines to write his pro se motions. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Brutal kangaroo. Please, find it on Amazon. Now, let's turn for a moment into political corruption. Later today, in fact, at 11 o'clock, so two hours from now, um, uh, Brian Benjamin, do you remember him, the former lieutenant governor of the state of New York? Well, he's been charged criminally. He's no longer running. And um, his, the cooperator against him, Mr. Migdal, we reported exclusively on his uh, guilty plea, very quiet in the MAG court. Uh, he has a proceeding, which we'll be covering. In other corruption news, Antonio Guterres, the Secretary General of the United Nations, wasting your money in the middle of slaughter in Ukraine and elsewhere. He stopped in to plant a tree in Mongolia, and now he's headed to South Korea, where I'm sure he's going to get down with Ban Ki-moon. You know what? As much as Ban Ki-moon was a, was a pretty mediocre Secretary General, he was a, a god compared to Guterres, who's corrupt censors and throws people out. So there's that. Let's turn now to EDNY, our new series. Yesterday we wrote a number of stories, not only about FEDIWAP, where the information is controlled, but about cases where there's no information at all, including U.S. versus juvenile mail. It's a case that'll be heard today. We asked the spokesman, who's the, like, just to be sure, like, are you disappearing a juvenile? No, no answer. It's sealed. The case is sealed. There was an answer. The answer was no comment. It's sealed. Not cutting it. The narco trafficker, no answer. More, more to follow. We're covering a case today about Run DMC. To be continued.